So once again, the um, AIX was in a bit of a dark spot with the beef and with the negative messages that he um, was getting uh, from mid, uh, or early to mid 2008, and then by uh, the time the, uh, of the beef with uh, the Savan gang in the fall and autumn of 2009, uh, sorry 2008. So a year on from 2008, um, the spring to. Um, 2009 January and um, it was a sort of a, a new start for kind of a new generation people have been added on uh, me included uh, who suddenly just started to actually intently uh, follow AIX uh, so it was kind of a musical beginning and um, back to Brookman studio to produce some hits um, uh, and uh, then by February uh, we started uh, into um, Back or diving back into the actual financial situation of uh, the world and the United States specifically, and um, you know uh, that was kind of a part one uh, or part two, sorry, to what was previously um, has been said. But uh, the last uh, time uh, there was a positive outlook from the real AIX or input uh, that was in February of two thousand and nine until the spring. Uh, came and it brought some darkness and then some brightness after that. So it was quite the contrast. And um, uh, many of us are familiar with the dark incident. Yeah, so let's look at the bright side um, first, actually. Um, this video, I guess I'm going to title it for what? Because. You know, we go to work when we can. We, we feed our family the best we can. We do what we can, you know, for tomorrow. And shit, fuckers can't even make it till tomorrow. I mean, if it's so bad in this country, and this is supposed to be the freest country on the planet, what are we getting for our freedom? You know, um, what's free? What's freedom? What's free in America? I mean, what was the dream like? I, I missed it. I missed the American dream because I was too busy trying to stay woke. Um, I don't know.